Welcome to the video. So a quick how to this time. So if you're on your Chromebook and you've got an Android app, maybe it's a game, maybe it's something else that's playing up and you want to reset it as if it was a fresh install. So to lose any local data, it's got saved. This is how you do it. It's similar to how you do it on your phone, but a bit more awkward than just sort of right clicking on an app. So come down into the bottom right, click on the cog to open up your settings and search for Android and then you're going to get Android preferences. You can click right into that. And then you've got this option for Android settings. Just click to select that. Try and maximize this to make it a bit bigger. Now this is going to look very familiar from using Android on your phone. So next off, we want to select apps. If you can't see all your apps, click to expand here where it says for me, see all 29 apps. So I'm going to find and select Roblox as an example here as mentioned. So Roblox is here. I'm going to click on that to select it. And I'm going to pick the option for storage and cache here that you can see I'm on. So I'm going to click into that. Um, if you think you've just got a bit of a glitch or a problem, you could just do clear cache first of all and then relaunch and see what happens. But I'm going to go for clear storage. As I say, this completely resets the app. So just to be clear, this is taking it back to as if it's a fresh install. So if you're worried about losing any data for any problem that's not stored in the cloud, um, just think about what you're doing here for a minute. But if you want to reset the app as if it's the first time it's been installed, so you haven't even signed into it yet, that's what you're going to do. Click clear storage. It's going to give you this warning to, you know, are you sure you want to delete all your app data again? Just think about it before you do. It's at your own risk. But if you want to reset the app as if it's a fresh install, Go ahead, click delete, and that's it done. And then if we launch the Roblox app now for the first time, or as if it's the first time, it's going to be a, a new launch. It's going to set up for the first time. It's going to ask you to download anything it needs for the first time. And of course, it'll be ready for you to sign in. So hopefully, if you're having any issues with a particular Android app on your Chromebook, that might help. Let me know in the comments which app you're having problems with or if this has helped. And in the meantime, please do check out this next Chromebook video from the channel.